Hi, Brentech here, where tech is made simple. So yesterday, I let you know that Google wants to supercharge Chrome with AI. And as I mentioned in the video, which will be linked down below and in the end screen in Chrome Canary 131, the latest preview version, Google has now renamed the experimental AI page as AI Innovations. And yeah, we've got a bit of a loud change with one of extra AI goodies that have been added. And go check that video out for more info. Now, it seems that Google really wants to push AI into every nook and cranny of the Chrome browser because AI Innovations is not only found in the settings of the browser, but if we head over to our developer tools, which as the name implies are tools where developers and technically minded individuals can really fiddle with under the hood components of the browser. And by the way, developer tools, just on a side note, can also be accessed by heading to your main menu, more tools, developer tools. So getting back to developer tools, with the developer tools, AI innovations has also now been placed in the settings of the dev tools. So if we head to our settings, we'll see here AI innovations. So it's not just in the settings of the browser, it's in the settings now of the developer tools. And yeah, it says AI innovations, boost your productivity with AI, things to consider obviously when using AI. And yeah, we get console insights, which is off by default. But if we toggle it on, it says helps you understand and fix console warnings and errors. When on, get explanations for console warnings and errors, receive suggestions and code samples to address these issues and then things to consider once again if you are using AR. Now, once that's toggled on, uh, just to demonstrate, if we head over to console and you have any errors in a session that have been generated, then what you can do, and I've just taken some screenshots to cut to the chase before posting because um, those errors, uh, every time I log, out the browser, those errors disappear. So it's making it a bit difficult to do it in real time. But nonetheless, um, if you see an error here in your console, once that um, feature has been enabled, then what you do is you would then right click on that error. Then you'll see understand this error. Then once you click on understand this error, it says understand console messages with AR, things to consider. You would then click on continue and then it takes you to the explanation of the error. Okay, let's break down while your browser is showing the so-called error. You've got the problem, possible reasons. If we head to the next one, you've got some debugging steps you can take, uh, you can go through. And if we head to the last one, you can see there's also possible solutions. So if you are a dev developer or really into tinkering with under the hood components of, of um, Chrome, I think this AI innovations with this new um, uh, console insights, I think would be a step in the right direction. But I think for your average home user, this isn't going to be um, of much interest. But nonetheless, it does seem that Google is wanting to kind of supercharge Chrome and push AI into every nook and cranny. So AI innovations now seems to be what Google is branding the AI when it comes to components um, that are using artificial intelligence in the browser. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.